Hey, hi, hello. It's me again. So your updated desktop made on Steam and it's broken, isn't it? And now your custom waifus no longer work and you're over here like this. <laughs> So first, we must make sure that you never have to appear here again. But first and foremost, go to Properties, come in here to Updates, set this to Until I Launch the Game. That will prevent this problem from happening in the future. With that being said, go back in here, right click, Manage, Browse Local Files again. Now if you're following my guide from last time, if we come back out here to Common, you should have Desktop Mate, this is the Steam version, and then Desktop Mate Instance 2. Once you're in local files, what you're going to do is just come over to the desktop instance 2 that you made. Not the Steam version, the local version that you made with Goldberg. Take this, drag it into Steam apps. What you're then going to do is right click, make a copy, paste it here, rename it to whatever you want. I did desktop made instance 1 local just so we know that this is instance 1 and 2 again. Take both of these, put them back into your common folder. Come in here, go to instance 1 local, launch it. Come in here to desktop main instance 2. Run it. Move you out of the way. And you're done. That's it. Following my guide made it so it was future proof. Now, if you didn't do that, I'm going to show you how you can downgrade your current version to be able to do this again. So if you didn't future proof it, what you're going to want to do is, is come in here and hit Windows R or switch for run. Then what you're going to do is, is you're going to take Steam slash slash open console. Take that paste it in here give it a minute it's going to open up the console for you then what you're going to want to do is take this specific line and i'm going to put this in the description for you you're going to do download deposit 330160 330 then you're going to take this long code 822-809-810-253-775-2112 and you're going to paste that in what that's going to do is tell your Steam to downgrade the version of the desktop mate that you are using. It will then tell you where it's going to put it. The most common place is going to literally be exactly where it's saved normally. It's going to basically be Steam, Steam Apps content, the application number that you put in here, the application number you put in here, and then this long number. Now, what that's going to do is give you the previous version of the game. Upon doing this, you will be able to follow the instructions in my previous tutorial about using Goldberg to make it so you only have a local version of the game. What this will do is not only make it so these versions will not update, it'll also ensure that by doing this, your game will not update until you know Melon Loader works again. Oh, and as always, they can never touch.